as an entertainer, content creator, and streamer, I apologize that this is gonna suck. <laughs> but, you know, whatever. It's still something I gotta do. Let me just uh, load in to the world real quick. I gotta... So, we're in Wizard's Den. I ate a bunch of bodies. Where am I? Am I in East? I'm in like East 2 or 3 or something like that, or maybe further. Um, what's in here? Sand. So that's all I did was just eat some bodies from our save. Uh, Alright, so 46105987. Four six one zero five nine eight one seven. All right. Okay. So, and then new game plus twenty eight. Spiral search. Boom. Okay. So that's what we got to do. We got to get to this coordinate right here, and then we got to cast end of everything. There's other ways to do it. You can. You know, the end of everything is just the easiest, <laughs> easiest way to do it. Most efficient, I guess. You can also spawn a great treasure chest in any way in that coordinate to get this. So you can use like a greed die to spawn a, the chest. You can use Leviathan. You can move Leviathan using Homebringer Teleport to that coordinate and then kill Leviathan in a location where that chest is going to spawn right on that coordinate. I just, right now, I'm not, my room is not set up for really streaming or content creation. I'm getting ready to move at some point, so let me just, we'll eat a few more in here. We gotta teleport back to the west. Journey to the west. I just want to make sure that I have plenty of poly immunity for hopefully the entire process, but... At least the first orb. At least the first one. So, I mean, that's a lot, but you can't underestimate the amount of time it takes to do this. Or the amount of time it could take to do it. As we learned already yesterday. Oh, man. Or we could get super lucky and get it really, really quickly. Hopefully that happens. <laughs> anyway, honestly, I just like watching you play, and I think you're really funny. I come here for you. Thank you. I appreciate that more than you'll probably ever know. Like, just immensely. Even though sometimes I have an attitude on stream. <laughs> it's just, streaming can be hard. Like, like yesterday, I was streaming, and... You know, I try to not be rude at all to anyone, especially you guys, you know? But sometimes, when when you're trying to be semi-entertaining, and you're trying to, to accomplish something and do something live, and there are, you get people who are, like, questioning everything you do, it gets, it, it gets overwhelming sometimes. It's just like, all right, just let me be me. You're here, like... You maybe not everyone is here for me, but like, you just let me be me. Let me do what I know how to do my way. You know, if I try to do it your way, that's where mistakes happen and things screw up and I get unhappy. <laughs> you know, yeah. So it's just like I try never. I get upset. I get pissed off. But every now and then, a little bit of that shows. I mean, I try to only bring that out when. Obviously, when, uh, if somebody's being a jerk in some way, like, legitimately, like, not, that doesn't happen 99.9% .9 of the time. It's like, I usually don't have anyone show up to my stream and just try to troll and stuff, but I try to just reserve the fury for them. <laughs> Yes. Okay, well, that's it. We're, we got 6,500 pretty much. That's plenty. We see one more on the way up. Yeah, let's just... 
Get you. It's weird how I think part of its body like sunk through the ground there. All right, back to the west. More than once. I think we're like in East Five where we were. Hey, Freezoid, thank you for the 17 months. Greetings. Y E S. Yes, yes, yes. Also, apologies if you don't like that sound effect or that uh, quote. And that. Wait, now we're in West? Oh, I guess it was not as far as I thought I was. I'm, I love the that. Like the Snoop Dogg, yes, yes, yes thing. I love it so much. I, I probably. I'll have more sounds again. It's just I have my stream deck completely filled right now. I'm going to have to get another one. One for just, or like I, there are other um, controllers I could use as well. I don't have to use just a stream deck. I do have like experience with other like audio equipment. Okay, I could just use something else to control soundboard, like sound effects and everything. All right. And now, all the way up. No, uh, not Steam Deck. I don't know. Like, see, I, I don't really do the handheld gaming thing. I have a Switch, and I have never undocked it, really. I barely even played it. I have Metroid Dread. I have not played Metroid D Dread yet. I was finishing Deathloop off camera. And I was like, what am I going to play after Deathloop? I'm trying to play a game off camera, too, now. Because I've... It's something I've struggled with for seven years, is like being a gamer, or somebody who likes and enjoys video games, but also struggling with the the knowledge, it's the truth, struggling with the truth of you can't just stream and you can't just make videos of everything you want to. You gotta pick and choose what works. And like some games just I can't play on stream. You know, like games like no, I didn't. Oh, we just started today. I did not get the pixel. Ugh. We just started for today. But yeah, like, Deathloop was one of the games I pretty much that was more enjoyable for me to play off camera than on stream. On stream, because the puzzles, it doesn't have, like, hardcore puzzles, but usually things I have to really think about like that, it's better to not stream. It's better off camera. All right. We have to get rid of all this, because this is all going to be in my way. All right. Now. Let's see. Put this over here for now. All right. Perfect. We don't want to accidentally use that wand when we're doing this, so that's a perfect placement of the wand to refresh right there. Um, okay. Okay. I think probably lower than that. So let's just, we don't have, okay. Restart like this. You already have a plan. Yeah. I mean, I have, I, I know how to, I've already done this. That's the difficult part is like, I've already done this. Like I did it the way for the video, like using the easy, the portal exit, but I've already, what we're doing right now, I've already done off camera. I've done a lot of testing with this in the past, but it's been months and like six months, probably at least. And doing anything for me, doing anything on stream is always harder. <laughs> it's always doesn't go right for me on stream. All right, position we're at. 10,000? 109,000? Oh, this is the temp. Dumbass. Watch, we were in the right spot, and then I moved. I don't know, actually, like, if using Luminous Drill is such a good idea. Maybe we should get spells to whatever. Because it's when I start shaving off little pieces of this that it... Starts getting really jank and like pushing me up one pixel here and there. All right. So we're at 0. 0.7, 107. <clears throat> wow, we went pretty deep. 
Ugh. Negative 5, 98. Negative 5, 5. Our X position is fine. We just need to go two pixels up. It should be fine. It should round to neg negative 6. It should round there. Let's just get rid of this. I don't want any pixels above me at all where I have to fly up. All right, now I forgot like what I had to do. Just dig down a little bit. Is that what I was trying to do originally? It's the problem with like being like having to Leonardo da Vinci this or something. Like, oh, I gotta make a sculpture out of invisible platforms. Anyway. <sighs> Make a platform far away and store your spells. You're not going to need going to any new game plus anymore and need the spells to fit orbs to finish it. Blah, blah, blah. I am. This isn't the last thing. I'm going to be. This run is not ending anytime soon. It's going to end months from now, probably. Um, there's a lot more I need the spells for, for what I'm planning on doing. This is not the, like, the main objective. Negative six, 96. Okay. So. <laughs> Is there a way to move one pixel at a time? Are you hinting at something? <laughs> Even So if I back up, like, doesn't matter. I'm not going to cheat it by reloading that backup. Mm-mm. <clears throat> Technically, yes. I, I mean, there probably, I know there is, there has to be. All right, so let's just give this a try. Nope, that's not gonna cast. Where's my long distance cast? Uh. Don't fall, dude. The poop! The circle of excrement. With all the, like, shaking and everything of the screen, I'm like... I don't know. Poop loin. <laughs> the problem after this is, like, getting the other two. That's going to be... We need to get Remove Explosion so that they don't get blown open. But with all the... Look at the poop on his face. What a dirty worm. Uh, see, having this perk sucks, and I can't get rid of it. All right. Don't move. Just please don't move me. We got it! First try. Okay. 34 damn orbs. Ugh. Okay, now we gotta do that two more times. And see, look at this. This is damn doomed. Yeah! Doomed. We have to do that again and move that chest to a parallel world with all of this uh, gas rising up everywhere. I and mean, it's clear now. But how do we get that chest not to break? I guess we have to spam, like Wito was saying, maybe, like circle of water, but I don't have water. It's gas. What liquid do I have? Get me out of here, please. I guess we could just do this. We're gonna have to remake that anyway. All right, so let's switch this around. Hell yes, that was, uh, Egg. Oh, look, and the sky. We're gonna, for hours, we get to experience the Amulet of Yendor sky. Ah, oh, that's amazing. I, this is my first time really flying around for a while. What if? What if there's a secret that you can only accomplish when you have 34 orbs? Like the cauldron or the eyes. What if you need this background? So, what we're gonna do, anyway... Can't you grab it with telekinesis? What, the chest? I can. Yeah. That's easy. 
it's the chest burning. They're very, very flammable. I have to bring a wooden thing to both parallel worlds. If it opens, if it burns, we're screwed and we got to try it again. In New Game Plus, this is where the nullifying altar is. It's like in the corner of near the lake and uh, frozen chasm, snow chasm, whatever, snowy chasm. But the supernova deletes the structure. However, as you can see, right around here, it's still here, nullifying altar. So if I was to like, in theory, build my own reservoirs for the materials, we could potentially still get rid of perks. Do I want to spend the time to attempt to do that? Probably not, but I might if we fail a few times. After doing this, after getting the 36th orb, we're gonna get it, no matter what. It might take, I might go completely insane, but um, also, before I forget, D-dubs won, thank you very much. Welcome. So this is the problem. Each pixel of this gas could ignite the chest because of my dumb gas fire perk. <laughs> like, I nullified all my perks earlier in the run, and I was like, thinking about which ones I should pick up. I'm like, we could, gas fire would be fine. We'll take that because it will make going through the cloudscapes easier. No big deal. Rip. Uh, we're producing all this gas from our blood. Anyway, this part, I might, we're probably not going to finish this today, right now. I just want to like theory craft and like figure out like how the hell we're going to attempt this. What if we get a great treasure chest and it has creepy liquid in it? I guess that would be a good thing for what we have to do. Maybe that's the way we should do this. Try to spawn a great treasure chest until we find creepy liquid and then flood the entire world with creepy liquid. Then the chest will not burn or ignite. That's another strategy we can employ. That would be very poetic for me as well, because back in you know the early days, back in early access and everything, I was always really in love with Creepy Liquid. And I was like, we have to find a way to spawn it for real. Like there has to be one pixel of brick wall Creepy Liquid emitter someplace in the world. And we set that on fire and it emits creepy liquid and I'm happy. But yeah, if I end up solving my the main problem of my everything run by having to spawn creepy liquid or find creepy liquid, and then that would be pretty cool. I would like that. But at the same time, would we... Would that screw up something? if the whole world is filled with creepy liquid. From doing the two or three or four creepy liquid runs I've done, fire particle, fire pixels still get created in creepy liquid. It doesn't actually, creepy liquid does not give anything the wet uh, stain. It doesn't give a stain at all. So if you're on fire, does it, does it put the fire out? I know if you're stained with toxic sludge, you can't, Creepy Liquid doesn't wash that stain off. We might be able to get Freeze Field Perk, I don't have it, and use that to, that puts out fires around me. Yesterday, we got the 34th orb very, very quickly. Very quickly we got it yesterday. Now we need to get the 35th and 36th orbs. The 34th orb was on this pixel right here, negative 696. However, if we go to Negative 20,000 around there. How do you get more than 33 orbs? One moment. You gotta get them in a great treasure chest on one pixel in the entire world. Or more than one pixel in the entire world, as it turns out. Because we can, to get the 34th, you gotta go in the main world, open a great treasure chest on one pixel, and that when that great chest opens, the orb will come out and you can pick it up for 34th. 
normally we thought, I thought that you'd have to then bring that great chest to Westworld and Eastworld. Like, bring two more, spawn that chest two more times on that one pixel. And then open the chest in West, West 1 and East 1 in order to get an orb that you can pick up in, in it again. Um, but this... Anyway. So here we go. We don't have to bring it. There are multiple pixels in the entire world. So we have to go to negative... Negative 20,000 and 772, and then negative 671y. All right, so let's take a look at that again. So it's going to be kind of at the end of the pyramid, the last chunk, but up in the sky. <clears throat> so probably, I don't even know if it's going to be below this. Let's go up this way. All right. And I guess I'll put a platform right here. We have infinite platforms using this build. Negative 21,000, negative 412. So we have to go... Not sure yet. Probably higher. And then... What was that? Negative 21,000. So we need to be at negative 20,000. 772. Yeah. Argon Vane and crew, what's going on? How you guys doing? Thank you very much. Hey, I gotta give you a shout out. Welcome everyone. We're doing uh completely mind numbing things right now. All my people, if you don't know who Argon is, make sure you go check them out. We need to go a decimal point, or two decimal points to the right. Oh, God. Come on. Just one more little... Hopefully that was it. Let's just speed this up. We're there. Just gotta do this. Don't mess up. <laughs> if you mess up. Yeah. <sighs> I mean, I know exactly what I have to do. I know exactly the inputs that I need to do. It's just, because the game is highly physics-based, Some it could, we need to encase, or we need to get to this, well, I'll show you. Hopefully we, we do this right now. Yes, we got it. 670, or 671, it's going to round up to, and then 772, we got it. All right, now, close this. Let's back up the save real quick. Oh, wait, let me leave the game. Boom. All right. Back up this real fast. I mean, if I... I'm not going to save Scum it. I, I backed up my save just in case we crash, which we probably will not. But, all right. Hang on. So, move that there. <clears throat> just don't mess up. We got to cast the end of everything. Oh, wait, I need alpha. I just put use this one. All right. Fly up. Cast end of everything. Fall straight down. Encase ourselves. Chainsaw. I'm gonna... Well, let's just go. We should be... We may have messed up. Hopefully we're good. <sighs> Where am I? Oh god. Alright. It's the invisibility perk too. It's like messing with me. I'm like, where'd I go? Help. But we can survive this easily because I've made so many preparations. The surviving it is not the hard part for me now. I hope so. I really, really hope so. Get out of here, worms. Go. Alright. Alright. 
cross your fingers and your toes. We got two chests. All right, it's over. We got it. We got two of them. <laughs> we got it. 35 orbs. Perfect. Now, let me see something. Where'd that other one go? Yeah! That chest despawn. Oh, we're making, look at the mystery fungus we're making everywhere. Well, we got it. Now, I'm just, I wish that, hmm. I should have put platforms underneath me too, because then we, we possibly could have gotten another one. Maybe. In, from that other chest. Anyway, okay. We killed Colmy with 32 orbs 21 times. And then we killed Colmy with 33 orbs. Now we're going for 36. If, if I can get 37, we're gonna try 37. Because it is possible to pick up a 37th orb. Oh, wait. That. Okay. So now, using black magic, teleport into... Oh, hey. Oh, I went the wrong way. We were already in west. Let's go to east world. Oops. But yeah, this we can't pick up this one because we already got this one. For anyone wondering about that, like, why don't you just take that orb? Come on, man. Jeez. From all that careful movement, now I'm like... This isn't the best spot to, to cast this. Let me flatten out an area a little bit, please. Boy. Alright, there we go. Nice. What was that? What was this? That is this wand right here. You can... It teleports you a really far distance. Including... What's doing the healing? That's this my teleport wand. All right, so we're in East World. No, we're in regular world. Now we, let's go to East World. All right. And now I'm going to try this one a little bit. Now we got to look for a positive number, 20,000 we'll go to, and then same thing. We'll just change this positive. Uh, east one. There's one right here. And then there was another one over here someplace, too. We'll try for this one. No. No. I mean, we're using vacuum field and then powder vacuum field. And then the circle of vigor to heal. All right, and we have the Lake of Vomit. We shifted, we changed all water. Oh, hey, and we got eyes right here. Look at this, nice. One of the unsolved mysteries. We already found them actually here. All right, so yeah, there's nothing here for us to align ourselves with. Let's just see where we are though. Um, it's probably too close to the lake. They looked high res. Maybe it was. I don't know. Mm -mm. Nothing. Nothing new. We're not using anything new. There hasn't been an update with spells or anything since April twenty third. That we know of. Nothing obtainable or nothing anyone has obtained anyway. 
Okay, so, geez, where the heck am I now? 29, 249, oh, 249. So we're gonna go way down. If there's one thing I have a surplus of, it's patience. Like I'm, I've always been an extremely patient person. I've had to be in life. And also, for content creation's sake, you need to be really dedicated. Set your mind on something and you have to stay dedicated to it. All right, so let's see where we are. Come on, man, stop turning invisible too. Wish I didn't have some of these perks. Let's see where we are right here. <laughs> it's art. The highest art. But with that said, like, I want to work on some sculptures. And after doing this, yeah, I want to make some sculptures. We'll make the Nala Games logo. But we need to be, maybe I'll do a stream. We're inside of platforms. Ugh. Maybe I'll, we'll do a stream with uh, Shadow Nya. 191, we're perfectly aligned there. 2664. All right, so 20, we need to go to 21, 220. 21, 220.5. No, it's going to round. Well, we're right in the middle. Is it going to round up or down? Or is it going to stay? Like, I think actually we'll be good, but it might. The decimal might screw it up. Anyway, now. Let's just do it. I'm not going to back up. All right. Mm. All right. So we got this, right? That's below us. Uh, we got to put the chainsaw back on this. Look at all those chests. We're going to see very soon what they contain. Waterstone and okay. Seed potions. Plant seed. Now look at all this crap everywhere. Now I really have to just get rid of all of these platforms. Let's, uh, I don't know. We gotta stay here. Tr going to one of the other coordinates would take too long. At least this, I know the general position of everything. Yeah, so there's one right here, too. 29442, and then Y537. Right on that biome separator line, pretty much. I think I might go over there, because it's gonna be a lot cleaner next to the tree. Let me just take a look. Is it going to be... Wait, is it going to be right on this? Maybe. Depending on the seed, there are many, many pixels, it turns out. Or not maybe not many, but there are a lot, a good number of pixels that spawn a great... I mean, spawn an orb in a great chest, it turns out. 30, 178, 474. What, what was our Y earlier? So we got to go even deeper than this, it looks like, right? That's cool, I think. <laughs> 29,442. So a little bit to the left. Okay, 29,441.9. That's good. We got it. Now we just have to get it. <laughs> Let's 
Let's see. I hope we didn't move at all. Please. Please. <laughs> Please. It always looks like we moved because of the camera, the way the camera moves in the game. Ah, oh, man. Oh, God. Yeah. Hey, what is going on, guys? Hey, Albino and company maggots. What's up? Thank you very much. I'm assuming that everyone already knows who Albino is here. But if you do not, definitely go check him out over on his channel and uh, show him some love. So we're working on something like ridiculously dumb and just crazy. So, all right. In the world of Noita, there are, there are, it's possible to get 33 orbs normally. There's 34, 35, and 36 orbs in a chest, in a great treasure chest on one pixel in the entire world, pretty much. So right now we are trying to find that pixel, 537. That is the correct depth that we're, we should be in right now. And uh, 29... 441. We need to go one pixel to the right. <laughs> and this is assuming we don't screw it up again, because we had it earlier and then screwed it up twice so far. We're in New Game Plus 28. Hey, Copium. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. 537. 29442. What are you talking about? Okay, well, that's cool. <sighs> All right. So this time, what do you think I should do? Back up the save, first off. I do have to go really soon. This, is my, this has to be my last attempt, and then we're gonna go raid somebody else, okay? Yeah, we're good. So I'm going to fly up, cast it. I mean, these two, 34 and 35, I've gotten by the same method. Flying up, straight up, casting it, and then... Doing that. I'm not even going to look. We're just going to sit here with our cursor above us centered into the circle of poop that's going to spawn very soon. Delicious. We have 238 seconds of poly immunity. Don't have to worry. Because the poly bolts, they actually go through these I'm not breathing. I am, but... Brown lion? <laughs> oh yeah, the brown lion. I don't even care, worms. You're fine. Don't worry about it. It's all good. That was from... Yeah! <laughs> y -E -S. <sighs> Sorry for the yes! this very loud scream right into the microphone. Yeah! 
36. So that's what happens. You can pick up another one. Whack. Right, let's get polyed and die now. All right, this one I can't pick up because it went off screen or something. I don't even care. 36 motherfucking orbs. Let's go. Let's go. Y E S. Yes, yes, yes. And now I'm sorry, everyone. First try. First try. We didn't spend four and a half hours doing that. Why would why would I, Fury Forged, spend four and a half hours trying to get two orbs in two great treasure chests in two pixels in the entire world? Nah. Nah. First try. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> yes. At four hours and twenty minutes into the stream. <laughs> yes. Okay. Ugh. All right, we're going to go raid somebody. Thank you, everyone who stuck around. Thank you, Albino, very, very much. Oh, man. Okay. That's just... I can't believe we did it, finally. Awesome. I was hoping we'd be able to pick up another one. As soon as I saw multiple great treasure chests, my first instinct was like, oh, no, we failed. Second instinct was, what if I can pick up more than one? But we couldn't. It didn't count. But I might try again to see if we can get 37. <laughs> Someplace else. I don't know. Anyway, on a different coordinate, maybe? Who knows? All right, guys. Thank you. Thank you all very, very much. Let's do this.